What does an AWS cloud engineer actually do? If this is a question that has been on your mind, then you've come to the right place. I've been working in the cloud for the past seven years and would love to share some insights with you. As you are interested in pursuing a career in the cloud and specifically as an AWS cloud engineer, I'll explain the day-to-day -day task and why this is one of the best tech roles that I've ever been in. Now, becoming an AWS cloud engineer is one of the most in-demand tech roles for this decade and beyond. And after watching this video, you'll be even more interested in pursuing this career route, knowing that it has the potential to make over $100,000 per year. Before we get started, you should check out my weekly cloud newsletter where I share free resources, tutorials, boot camps, and so much more helping you make your cloud move. Firstly, let's understand what cloud computing is and think about cloud computing as a virtual library that stores all your favorite movies, shopping sites, photos, and documents. Instead of them being stored on a single computer or a bunch of hard drives at home, everything is stored on the internet, which is what we refer to as the cloud. Now, in the past, businesses had to keep all their digital files in a large physical space known as data centers, which were both expensive and complicated. However, now with AWS, businesses can store all their digital files and data in the cloud. This way, they can use as much space as they need without having to build and maintain expensive data centers themselves. An AWS cloud engineer is like a digital superhero for businesses. They help companies move their data from old chunky buildings like data centers to sleek, spacious and AWS cloud. This allows businesses to perform tasks faster, cheaper, and more efficiently. It's like having a magic trick that turns their heavy backpacks full of papers into a single lightweight digital tablet. As an AWS cloud engineer, you'll play a critical role in enabling companies to leverage cloud technology to its fullest. Whether it involves migrating their entire databases to the cloud or developing new applications within a cloud environment, by designing, implementing, and managing cloud-based systems, you'll contribute to the operational efficiency and cost reduction, whilst also playing a key role in innovating and shaping the future of cloud services. As an AWS cloud engineer, you'll be responsible for a wide range of technical tasks and challenges that require a broad skill set. You will architect robust solutions on AWS, cloud infrastructure using tools like Terraform, and design seamless CI-CD pipelines for automated software deployments and ensuring the security of your cloud network is safe. Because the cloud is always growing and changing, and you'll be responsible for architecting solutions and then also bringing them to life, making sure everything fits just right and works like a charm. AWS offers over 200 distinct services. You'll always be learning new things and finding better ways to use the services. This continuous learning and invasion aspect is vital to the role and will appeal to those who thrive on constant growth. Your expertise will extend to designing and implementing cloud architecture for cloud migrations, including setting up infrastructure's code, ensuring CI CD practices, and advising the best cloud services to meet the project requirements. You will need to have the ability to present a viable solution and execute them efficiently in order to transition to a successful cloud system. So you think of a design, you then present it, you get approval, and then you go and build it. Aspiring to become an AWS cloud engineer requires not only comprehending the responsibilities and duties involved, but also becoming strong and proficient in essential technologies and tools, which lay the groundwork for cloud engineering. Now, apart from the hands-on technical work as an AWS cloud engineer, you will also engage in strategic planning and collaborate with cross-functional teams. You'll work with software developers, quality assurance specialists, and project managers to make critical decisions about which applications to migrate to the cloud and how they are optimized for performance and scalability. Now, the crux of cloud computing lies in the cloud platform itself. AWS is the top leader in the cloud service provider space. My personal experience revolves around AWS too where I've done the AWS professional level certifications. 
Now you also have infrastructure as code, which is a vital aspect of cloud engineering. By writing code, we automate the process of provisioning and managing cloud resources, eliminating manual tasks and improving efficiency using key tools like Terraform, AWS CloudFormation, and AWS CDK. Terraform is an excellent starting point because it's cloud agnostic. Now, while Terraform is recognized as a standard IAC tool, many organizations also use cloud-specific infrastructure as code tools to optimize their cloud infrastructure natively, like CloudFormation and AWS CDK. We also need to think about continuous integration and continuous deployment practices because they are crucial in modern software development. They enable the automation of building, testing, and the deployment of applications to ensure swift and reliable software releases. Some of the leading tools in this space include Jenkins, GitLab CI, and GitHub Actions. Now, although Jenkins may have a steep learning curve, it provides a solid foundation due to its widespread use and adaptability to various CI/CD scenarios. GitHub Actions, on the other hand, is gaining popularity for its seamless integration with cloud platforms and, of course, the broader GitHub ecosystem. You also need to think about containerization as an AWS cloud engineer. Docker and Kubernetes are at the core of containerization. Docker simplifies the packaging of application and their dependencies, making them more portable. Now, Kubernetes extends its capability by managing the deployment, scaling, and operation of these containers, acting as an orchestration system. Now, although mastering containerization is an ongoing journey for many, including myself, it remains a valuable skill set for any AWS cloud engineer. It plays a crucial role in enhancing application deployment and scalability. Now, of course, you will know about Docker and Kubernetes, but you also need to know about the native AWS containerization services. Now, with all of that said, we also need to think about programming skills because they are crucial for AWS cloud engineers. Learning to code can significantly improve your career trajectory. Python is an excellent choice due to its simplicity, versatility, and of course, a widespread use across cloud platforms. Developing coding skills can broaden your technical capabilities, enabling you to automate tasks, build custom solution, and engage with more deeper technologies. And of course, building better cloud projects. Becoming an AWS cloud engineer involves mastering these core set of tools and technologies. From selecting a cloud platform to embracing infrastructure as code, CI, CD, containerization, and programming, I know it's a lot, but you don't have to learn all of these at once. Each element plays a crucial role in shaping your skills and success as an AWS cloud engineer. As an AWS cloud engineer, projects are where you can gain real world insights and experience the most fulfillment. The diversity of projects in cloud engineering offers unique challenges and opportunities to innovate. Now we're going to dive into eight cloud projects that you can work on as an AWS cloud engineer. Now imagine you're using the AWS's magic tools like EC2, which is Elastic Compute Cloud for powerful computing to keep your websites running smoothly during sales. And also you can use S3 to store all the images and details of your products. It's like setting up a super fast conveyor belt, i.e. your EC2, for the checkout line and having the endless back room, your S3, that never runs out of stock, which is, of course, your online shop. For hospitals, you can use an RDS, which is a relational database service to keep patient records organized and easy to find. And then you can use S3 to securely store all the scans and reports. It's as if you have a super secure filing cabinet RDS with a lock only doctors can open and a vault, i.e. your S3, for all your important documents. Now the next project, it could be helping HR teams with AWS Lambda and Amazon DynamoDB. You can use AWS Lambda, which lets you run code for different tasks without setting up servers, and DynamoDB, a fast database service for all your employee info. It's like having a team of robots, i.e. your Lambda, to do the heavy lifting and the electronic filing system, DynoDB, that finds information in a blink of an eye. 
The next project that you could be doing is assisting startups with AWS CloudFormation and Amazon EC2. Now, working with startups, you could introduce CloudFormation to them to automatically set up and manage AWS services with templates. It's like following a recipe to bake a cake. And with Amazon EC2, they get the computing power that they need to run their applications. It's like building a house with the perfect blueprint. CloudFormation. <laughs> I say perfect, but we all know CloudFormation has its flaws. Anyway, you can also adjust the power supply, i.e. VC2, as it needs to grow with the demand. Now, we also have some extra cool projects like disaster proofing business with Amazon Route 53 and using AWS Backup. Did you know you can use Amazon Route 53 to keep the internet traffic flowing to the right places? Even if something goes wrong. And then you can use AWS backups to keep data safe. It's like having a traffic cop, i.e. your Route 53, who knows the alternate routes and a safety deposit box, i.e. your AWS backup for your valuables. Now you could also be making sense of big data with Amazon Redshift and AWS Glue. To help companies understand their massive amounts of data, you set up Amazon Redshift for data warehousing and AWS Glue to prepare and move the data. Think of it as having a massive library, which is your Redshift, where everything is neatly organized and also an efficient librarian, which is your AWS Glue, who knows where everything is. Now, you could also be connecting gadgets to the internet with AWS IoT Core. You can use AWS IoT Core to connect and manage all those internet connected devices, making sure they talk to each other and work together smoothly. It's like being the conductor of an orchestra, which is the IoT Core, where every instrument, i.e. devices, plays in harmony. For AI projects, you can introduce Amazon SageMaker, which helps you build, train, and deploy machine learning models quickly. It's like having a high-tech lab, SageMaker, where you can create smart robots that can learn and improve over time. In each of these projects, as an AWS cloud engineer, you will have the power of using the wide array of AWS services to cast spells that transform businesses, making them more efficient, secure, and ready for the future. It's a role where technology meets creativity, offering endless possibilities to innovate and solve real world problems. Now, as the cloud continues to expand, so too will the need for skilled AWS cloud engineers to navigate this ever evolving landscape, making it an incredible field to be in. For those intrigued by the possibilities, pursuing a career in cloud engineering promises a journey filled with learning, growth, and a chance to make significant impact on the future of businesses and technology. And that's a wrap for this video. If you liked it, smash the like button and I'll see you on the next one.